Three people, including a teenage boy, died when a sports car being chased by police in Indianapolis collided with another vehicle just minutes after officers entered their pursuit, authorities said Wednesday. An Indiana state trooper began the pursuit Tuesday night when the driver of a Dodge Challenger fled the officer's attempt to pull it over on suspicion of reckless driving on Indianapolis' far east side, state police said. The pursuit lasted about 12 minutes, traversing several city streets before shifting into rural areas of adjacent Hancock County and then back toward Indianapolis' east side, police said. State troopers and other officers tried to deploy stop sticks but couldn't get into position to stop the car, police said. After the car left a rural, low-populated area and began returning to Indianapolis' east side, Troopers ended their pursuit at 9.50 p.m. in Perth due to the driver's aggressive, reckless driving. About five minutes later, police learned there had been a serious crash involving two vehicles close to the area where the pursuit had started. Officers found that the car, which was carrying three people, drove through a red light and collided at extremely high speed with a vehicle being driven by a woman who was traveling alone. The woman who died at the hospital was identified as Michaela Hankins by the Marion County Coroner's Office. Two male passengers who were extricated from the Challenger's wreckage were pronounced dead at the hospital and identified by the Coroner's Office as Christian Leva Gonzalez and Jose Gonzalez Jr.